everyone, welcome back to our channel. Today we would like to talk about the top 5 Atlantic City hotels. It may get a bad rap, but it's our favorite weekend getaway from New York City. And we're going to give you the 5 best places to stay when you come to Atlantic City. In our opinion, the 5th spot is tied between Bally's and Caesars. We actually have stayed in Bally's and Caesars. It's a little dated now. There's definitely newer hotels and casinos in definitely. Atlantic City. And the unfortunate thing about both of those hotels, they don't actually include their pool access and their price. There's an extra charge on top of the resort fee to use their indoor pools. And that's kind of a huge downside. Like, you're going to charge us $30 for a resort fee per right. night. And then on top of that, charges extra for your pool access, and that's just not cool in our opinion. Right. But they're fun casinos and hotels that you can stay at. In our opinion, number four is Hard Rock AC. Hard Rock Hotel recently opened in 2018 and very well decorated, and we really like going there as well for gambling. Yeah, absolutely. It's got a ton of memorabilia from your favorite artist, and it has great restaurants right on the boardwalk, including one of our favorites in all of Atlantic City, Council Oakfish. Our big negative though for that is there's only an indoor pool and it was ice cold when we went in October. It's not heated and that's kind of a huge downside. And on top of that, there's no bar near the pool so you have to go all the way down to the first level right. in pool clothes, freezing in the AC and trying to get a drink. It's not an ideal situation. So that's why it's number four on our list. Number three is Harris Hotel. It used to be our favorite hotel because it has the best indoor pool in Atlantic City. In my opinion, it still has the best indoor pool. The pool is 21 plus throughout the entire day and at night it becomes the pool after dark nightclub. And they've recently redid the rooms as well as the restaurant area. They included a new Gordon Ramsay Steakhouse where we used our diamond celebration dinner and it was super delicious. Of course, the downside is they don't have an outdoor pool during the summer for adults only. And honestly, the customer service there has just really gone downhill as of late. So even though it's part of Total Rewards program, just like Caesars and Bally's, it's just not the same hotel it used to be three to five years ago. And unfortunately, we've moved on to the top two hotels as being our favorite now. So number two is Ocean Casino Resort. It recently changed its name from Ocean Resort Casino, I guess? <laughs> Yeah, they've had a few changes of ownership. They originally opened as Revel in 2012, so it's the newest casino grounds, actually. Everything is big and nice here. They're part of the Hyatt chain of hotels, so that actually is helpful. For example, this Saturday night, we stayed here using Gokche's free night certificate in Hyatt. Ocean also has a ton of other activities to do for the entire family, including the largest top golf suite in the entire Northeast, and it's got a great location at the end of the boardwalk on the beach, and we really love it during the summer months, but there's, I guess, a few things that keep it from being from the top spot. So the adult pool area at Ocean Casino Resort has changed. It used to be we go there and then pay for your chair, which included the minimum spend of any drinks and food you would like to consume throughout the day. Now, when we went yesterday, they said that you have to pay a fixed price for the chair, which doesn't come with anything. Right, it's now $70 for a day bed with nothing included. So essentially you're out about $100 as compared to last year when it was $175, but included you know, on $175 was food and beverage. So basically they didn't charge you last year, they just asked you to spend a certain amount. So it's kind of a huge negative because at our top spot, there's lounge chairs at their adult pool for free. It's right. included in their resort fee. So yeah, it's one of those things. It's unfortunate to kind of be uh, nickeled and dimed on top of spending, you know, a decent amount of money for a hotel room and a resort fee. Like that right. should be included. It should be extra Agreed. in our opinion. Yeah. So then getting to our top hotel, it shouldn't be that much of a surprise anymore at this point. If you're familiar with Atlantic City, it's the Borgata. Yeah. Borgata has a lot to offer from indoor pool to outdoor pool, from the interior design to customer service, and it's been our favorite spot so far. Absolutely, and they get even the little things right, and that's so, so important. They don't charge you extra for things like chairs. You go to the adult pool, you get a chair for free, first come, first serve, and then anything you want to order on top of that is extra. They recently opened the water club pool to anyone over 21 plus which is hugely helpful during the winter months because you could get an adult-only indoor pool. Right. And that is, of course, a very important thing to us when you know we're not coming to Atlantic City with children. We don't want to go to a pool where there's children around. That's just our opinion, of course, but we understand families come to Atlantic City. Right. 
Thanks for sticking around and hopefully this was a helpful video for you. When you come visit Atlantic City, you know, you will know uh, what you're going to encounter with. And where the best places to stay are. And if you like this video, if you found it informational, we're going to do more travel tips, hotel reviews, airline reviews coming up. Definitely hit that subscribe button, ring that bell for notifications, and please give us a thumbs up, but hit the like button if you, uh, you know, found this video helpful. We'd really appreciate that. It means a lot to us. <laughs> yeah, thanks so much, guys. Take care. Bye.